The gold foil experiment performed under Ernest Rutherford's direction, A, confirmed the plum pudding model of the atom, B, led to the discovery of the atomic nucleus, C, was the basis for Thomson's model of the atom, D, utilized the deflection of beta particles by gold foil, and E, proved the law of multiple proportions. Well, actually, it disproved the plum pudding model of the atom, and by having the alpha particles rebounding off of the target and being deflected, it actually showed that there was something very positively charged in the middle of the structure. And that was later found to be or named the atomic nucleus. And again, it actually disproved Thomson's model of the atom. It used alpha particles, not beta particles. So the answer here is B. It led to the discovery of the atomic nucleus.